This is DC Denton Crow Crusader. And what do we have here on the field? A few little ducks, a few pigeons, a few crows. Um, we have kids walking to school so we have to make sure that we don't get them in our video. It's uh, May 6th and yes. If you notice this big tree behind where I used to live in that uh, gray and blue building there um, in the uh, background, there's only one bird there. That whole tree used to be full. Uh, they do poison birds there. When I was living there, it poisoned birds. And now look, there's only one bird there. Where are the rest of them? So I find that very strange. Um, very strange indeed. Normally the whole top of that tree is full. But we are missing birds. We are missing crows. Definitely. About uh, between six to 10 crows are missing. So I, I guarantee you, it's not just uh, not just about uh, scaring them away. It's also about killing them, right? So they never come back. Let's put down our sunflower seeds, lilies. Well, those little kids were screaming here about something. Okay. There we go. I guess about 15 pigeons, not many. About half of what we used to have. But we know what happened to those poor guys. The other day, not Sunday, but uh, Saturday, I have to upload those videos. Um, it was busy. Weekend packing, this and that. And um, And the uh, Otter Lang had their anti-bird device on. So that scared away some of the birds. I think that Seymour up on the uh, roof there of the shopping center, I'm not 100% sure, we're on the ramp. But both very, very quiet today. I don't see Georg Schmidt's van. He should be here today. I guess it's about 7.30. We're very early today, but I wanted to get the food out early before the uh, idiot hayfully people show up. The little duckies. Just waiting. Right in the background. The little nuts here. I also got a nice big bag. Peanuts here. Oh, here's our little mule gull. And uh, could that be, um, could that be Seymour? Here's our little mule gull. Hey, guy. What you doing, honey? Yeah, you're waiting, huh? He's waiting for the food. Well, we have a nice assortment here. And we have some noodles. There we go. They make an unusual sound, right? It's much different than silver gull. That might be Seymour. 
No, that's not Seymour. That's Seymour. Seymour's driving everybody away. See? That's our little Seymour. Look at our little Seymour. Seymour. Seymour, honey. Get in there and get your eggs. Go ahead. That's two eggs. That's three eggs. Mm -hmm. That's four eggs. Look at that. It's driving, keeping everybody away. Our little Seymour. Now he's eating some of the leftover cat food. He loves that too. Mm -hmm. I see more. Protecting your little feeding station? Yeah, I think so. Funny, he doesn't mind if the... Uh, if the crows or pigeons eat, but he doesn't like the uh, mule gull or the uh, or the other silver gulls. Poor little Lucas is standing there, wants to get in there. There he goes. There goes our little Luca. Beautiful, beautiful. There he goes. Seymour's taking off now. He's gonna head to the lake, get something to drink. It's supposed to rain today. It was supposed to have rain from that other large storm to clear the air of these sands, but another hard night of sleeping. I don't know, the storm may be uh, passing us by as well. I'll have to see. Well, I want to wish you, uh, got to get moving, got a lot of things to do today. Uh, Millie's holding his own, and uh, Chi Chi's doing a lot better, and so right now I'm very happy with, uh, with the progress of the kitty cats. So, it's all good news. I want to wish you a great day, hope you had a wonderful weekend. Another busy week, another holiday week, holiday coming up on Thursday, Pentecost, uh, Christi Himmelfart, that's what they call it in, in German, and uh, love your birds, stay safe, have a great day, and uh, fight the good fight, stick up for our little little feathered friends and all our little fur friends out there um, trying to survive in this very harsh world. This is DC Danton Crow Crusader over now.